Hi everyone, it's uh, Chris here along with Andrew. We're back for another one of our beverage reviews. Yep, happy Labor Day, just saying. Well, yeah, so with summer coming to its winding end, which I'm sad, my favorite season, I, I found, I came across this beverage. It's made by Steel Reserve, the Alleroy series, and it's Tiki Edition Island Punch. I mean, I don't think you need much to know that I'm a tiki man. <laughs> I know. I can't, if a cannibal decided to eat you, he would have a steak with a tiki man on it. Yep. <laughs> wouldn't, that, wouldn't that be something? Anyway, crack that shit open. So I have no idea what it tastes like, like many other things we've viewed. I've never had this before. Oh, oh, wait, Chris, I forgot something. We have a special guest joining us today before we jump the gun. Okay. Uh, he should be no stranger to this show, as I believe he's joined us once before. My own twin brother, Matthew J. Broderick. What, Ferris Bueller's coming? Yes, he is. Let's freaking go, guys. All right. He, he, he has introduction music. Oh, that's right. Size air guitar in it. Pour that. You know, if you uh, tilt the glass, it won't foam as much. <laughs> hey, I have bartending experience. How about you? I do not. All right, that's what I thought. Oh, also, while we're pointing, I wanted to make an announcement. We're looking to make Chris and Andrew uh, beverage t shirts. Uh, if you watch the show frequently, leave in the comments. I'm sure the one insane person. Well, we're, we're going to surprise you in the church. We're not going to talk about the signs yet, but. We'll, we'll, we'll I, didn't I didn't tell you. How about one that says Mongo? You know how when I start, I say, How are your bodies? That would be a good one. Yeah. You know? We could have one with a picture of Matt that, like, just smiling ear to ear like the Cheshire Cat that says Crazy Train on it. Hey, this is only the second episode, yeah, though. Well, you know. Hey, I'm like the Shemp of our Yeah, he's crew. like the Shemp of the beverage review. Like, I don't disappoint, but I'm in very few episodes. Yeah. yeah and how is your body? Uh, you know, firm. I know. All it's right, it. anyway, here you go. Thank All right, what are we Now, what are we drinking? So, once again, it's a, tea, it's a tiki drink. It says Island Punch. All right. All right, cheers. It's very typical. It's very, what do you expect the punch to taste like? I can't say any more. I can't say any less. It would be really good on ice. Like, like if you have like a blender and you make like a slushy drink, this would be a good alcohol. It's kind of good. It is actually good. It's, I was expecting, I didn't really It's good, it. but it's not like, oh my God, great. I thought I it was know, good. For Steel Reserve, their products are usually, uh, well, they're usually not so good. But this one, I think this is my favorite thing I've ever had from Steel Reserve. That being said, it's like, it's not, it's okay. It's not super good. I'm only going to give it like uh, a six out of 10, I think. It reminds me of soda with alcohol in it. Mm. So I give it as well a six out of 10. I'll be a little bit nicer. I'll give it a seven. It's it's good on a hot summer's day. It's a pretty hot day out today. It's keeping mm. us cool. So anyway, till next time. And also a, it's the color of a dehydrated man's urine, which is also delicious. So it gonna, definitely is. Okay. I wish you would have pointed that out. But, uh, but, uh, but well, I, I, I won't lower my number. Oh, Ooh. So anyway, until next time, peace out. Mm -hmm. Bye.